How? How can YouTube videos make money? Here's how making money off of YouTube works basically. Alphabet owns Google and Google owns YouTube. Now almost all videos that are published on YouTube are making money for Google. Google is running advertisements on them, whether the creator wants to or not. Now if the creator, that is the person who published the videos, has reached 1,000 subscribers plus a few other milestones, they have the option of enabling monetization so they may take a portion of what Google earns off of their own videos. So I had this theory which is if I record enough videos of other people's trains and publish them on YouTube and they get enough views over a long enough period of time, I could eventually pay to build my own railroad using the power of the internet. And that is how a person makes money off of train videos. And that is how I will pay for my railroad once I reach a thousand subscribers. But even if it was reached, it would take a number of views beyond reckoning millions to make that much money. Tens of millions. But my lord, there is no such views. Well, never mind. You see, I have learned the ways of the YouTube algorithm. And with that, I have become the most popular rail fan in the Carolinas, as far as I'm aware of at this moment. With 30,000 subscribers. And now, I will go out, and I will address my army of followers. Where? Right there. This video could be watched by tens of thousands of people. Will it have Thomas in it? No. Then it probably won't even hit a hundred in the first week! Never mind, I have to make my address now. Faithful foamers, I have made my first modification to the hand car. I actually did it way back in August, but I did not feel like announcing it until this time. I bought what I needed at the Gastonia train show. It was my last act of teenage rebellion. This is a test to escape my past and go beyond my predecessors.
Quick, your bureaucracy! Tweeting! You people have been mispronouncing my one YouTube channel's name for years! It is 19 0. I numbered it after the piece of rail equipment I always knew I would get. Yes! This is my plan all along! To surpass all those who came before me! And I will. <laughs> You can't give it that number. Why not? That's illegal! It's not illegal! Now pay attention. I know Nickel Plate Road 190 is a famous engine, but it was built by Alco and I don't think that Doyle McCormack cares. Are you crazy? I'm talking about the other one! A steam engine? A green one? Oh. Well, you see, that engine's over in Great Britain and I don't think that they care about it. Oh, no! no! The well, one listen. at- this is perfectly normal. Lots of engines and other pieces of equipment shared the same numbers way back when. You see, all this, my lawnmower has that number. My truck has that number. My dad's tractor has that number. And my dad's Jeep has that number. Okay. Alright, now come on, I got a story to tell about how all this mess started. It was a long time ago. Somebody was trying to intimidate me, saying that me using their number was flirting with copyright infringement. Now I knew they were a bunch of slack liars, but I was scared of them. I would look and I would be filled with fear. But now, I fear this no more. <laughs> He's won, and he knows it. You can see it in his eyes. He's become the ultimate creation. <laughs> And now, I have become the ultimate rail fan. Standing right here behind me. Behind you. And I would look off and I would say, Ah, oh, your beauty is beyond compare. Or no, 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 it says, I say, I say, Once I looked and I had, For a long time I, I heart, and, uh, I would look and I would be filled with fear. But now, I fear this no more! <laughs> I hate this so much! <laughs>